Hey guys, and welcome back to my video. So in this video, I'm going to be unboxing my Illumicrate and my Afterlight for the month of August. Right? Yes, I think. So yeah, we have the Afterlight and the um, regular YA box and the Afterlight box. So let's go ahead and see which one is first. So I think this one actually might be the Afterlight one. Yeah, so this is this month's Afterlight box, um, which I'm very excited for. Um, if you know the box, then it will be too. So, this one we have two books in because they gave you the option to order her first book, which I was very excited for because I missed out the first time they did it. So, I was happy that they offered that up. But before we get into these books, let's go um, to the item that they included for this month. So, the first item here is this little thing right here, which is it just says the kiss, it's a body butter bar. Um, so yeah, that's nice. And then if we open it, it's like a little heart. Um, it's a body butter bar. So yeah, and it smells nice. So that's really nice of them. It's cool, I guess. And then we have the art print inside here, which is the author's letter behind it. So yeah, I really love this art print. It's really, really stunning. Um, I like this a lot. And then we have. The last item they included is this box, um, which they the science of love experiments of the heart. Um, this is a really nice design. So it's supposed to look like a book, and it's so pretty. I love everything about this. And then like it's about little like blue pages, um, and then you open it, and look at that, very very cute. They just keep things inside of here, and I like that a lot. I love receiving these type of things. Um, yeah, these are very cute. So let's go ahead and get into the box here. Um, let me see which one is the first one and which one is the second one, or a newer one. So this one is the first one. So let's go ahead and open this one first. This is not a series, so I don't know why I'm saying it like it's a series, but this is her debut um, book, and that is... The Love Hypothesis uh, by Ali Hazelwood, and I actually hated this book. I ended up giving this one two stars, but um, I still wanted it for my collection. Um, this is really pretty. It has like these lime, like very blue pages, which are really nice. And then they have character gold falling on the actual hardcover. Um, so yeah, I'm through that. Decided to get this because I read this author's three novellas that she released um, earlier this year, and I love the novellas. I ended up giving them four or five stars each. Um, so I might read the Love Hypothesis again just to give it another shot and see if I will like it. Um, but yeah, these aren't signed or anything. Um, I'm pretty sure these are just like digital signatures on here, but. These are really pretty. So I just had to own them for my collection because um, I love collecting uh, special editions. Even if I didn't like this book, um, I'm still hoping to love her new one since I did love the three novellas that she released. Um, so hopefully I will love her new one. So let's go ahead and actually get into it that now. This is this right here. Um, so yeah, this month's book for the Afterlight is Love on the Brain by Ali Hazelwood. So I was very excited for this one. Um, and I really hope to love this one because I love the novella. So I don't know why I didn't love the love, the love of this. Um, but this is really pretty. They just did a different colorway to it. And this one has pink sprayed edges, which are really nice. Um, and again, these are just printed um, signature on them. And then we have nice gold forming of the two main characters on the hardcover, which I love. Um, these are very really cute, so I just had to own them. Um, even if I don't like this book, um, I'm still glad I have to own them because they're just really, really pretty. Um, so like I said, I do hope to love this one since the novellas were so great, but I'm just so confused on to why. I didn't love the love of this. That's why I want to reread that one and see if I would enjoy it. But I'm very happy to own these in my collection now. They're so pretty and look 
amazing next to each other. So happy about that. So let's move on to the actual um, box for this month for August. And we already know what the book is because they told us and that is April. Um, but this month's theme is knowledge is power um, for August. It's nice. Okay, so the first item inside here is this little journal right here, which is really, really pretty. I love the folding on here, but it's just like a little journal, um, I think. Or actually, it seems to be like a reading journal, which is nice. Um, and then they have character artwork on the inside throughout. But yeah, it's just like a little reading journal, which is really nice. And they have like reading logs, monthly TBRs, and then like, character art. And then these aren't dated, so you could just do them whenever. Um, these are, this is actually really nice. I really love this a lot. Um, I wonder if it says um, what type of characters they are. There's a reading journal and planner, and um, it includes um, dark academia characters and quotes throughout the book, which I didn't see, but. I'm sure they are in there, but it doesn't say which characters are in which books, but maybe it says in the book, but that's really, really cool. I really like that a lot. So this is the next item inside here, so let's go ahead and open this up. So here it is. Um, there's swords and stuff. I think this pops out. Yeah. I like this. It's just like a pencil case, which is nice. Um, yeah, and you just put the little pencils inside here and like it like stands up on your desk. Um, that's nice. Um, I like it and I say knowledge is carnage. You can't have it without sacrifice on the thingy. So yeah, this is nice. I like it. Um, I don't know if I'll actually use it though because I really don't. I don't know, maybe I will. But yeah, that's nice. So the next item here is a enamel pen inspired by Bunny by Mona Award, Award actually. Um, and this is really, really pretty. I love this enamel pen. Very, very cute. I love this a lot. This is really nice. I really like this. So I'm happy with this enamel pen. Next, uh, the next thing we have is a stamp set. Um, it's inspired by Lesson, a Lesson Inventions by Victoria Lee. So this includes one set of rubber stamps and one stamp block, but the ink isn't included. So I just don't understand why they would give us something and not give us ink to use. Um, so that kind of sucks. So here's our little stamps, which they look nice. I do like them. And then we have the stamp block. I don't really know how to use this, so I guess we'll see. But yeah, it's nice that they don't give us stamp you like ink to use um but luckily i have like a whole bunch of inks right here but it still sucks like you gotta go out of your way to buy ink to use them and then the last thing is character bookmarks from the book of the month which is babel or babel however way you want to pronounce it um both of them are the right way to say it um but yeah these are really pretty i like the character i like when they um uh, illuminate this um character bookmarks for the books that is included. These are nice. They're cute. I love them. So yeah. Now let's get on to the actual book, which is very, very big and thick. So let's go ahead and take it out of here. And it did a lot to this book, which I'm really excited. So here we have Babel and it's like part slipcase. Um, this is stunning. I really love this. So pretty. It would look amazing on the shelf. And then we have the book. Let's all take that out. Yeah, this is really, really pretty. I really love this. We have the tower on here and on the back. So I don't know, I feel like they could have done something different to be honest, but it's still really nice and I really like it. And then we have these beautiful spread digital printed edges, which says an act of transaction is it, it, always an act of betrayal. Sorry, I can't read, but <laughs> yeah, this is really, really stunning. Um, and then we have the end pages here, which are nice. 
Um, yeah, I think they're cute. I do like them. Um, they're kind of simple though. Um, and then it is signed by the author, and I love this um, signature page. Really, really pretty. Um, yeah. So that's the book for this month, Babel. Um, I really like this. I like what they did with it. Um, and I really can't wait to see um, my Fairy Loot one to arrive because Fairy Loot also did it for their adult box, which hasn't arrived yet, but um, I'm very excited for that. Um, but this is really pretty. I really like this a lot. But yeah, that's everything that we received this month from Illuminate from Afterlight and their regular box. Um, let me know what you guys thought of these books and the items that they included for this month. Um, the box was decent. Um, I like the items for the most part. I love the books a lot. They're really, really pretty. Um, so yeah, let me know your thoughts on, on everything. Um, make sure to give it a thumbs up, comment below, um, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!